General Hospital spoilers reveal that Molly has made significant progress in her investigation into John's death, and the clues she's uncovered increasingly support her suspicion that Sonny is involved in the case. Although Molly is getting very close to the truth, she also understands that exposing Sonny will not be an easy task, given his immense power and influence in Port Charles. However, what Molly didn't anticipate is that Carly, the most important woman in Sonny's life, is his greatest weakness. Carly has long been someone Sonny trusts and protects, but that trust also makes her the weakest link in his entire defense. Molly begins to realize that if she wants to bring Sonny down, she must target Carly. Despite being strong and independent, Carly's deep emotional connection to Sonny makes her vulnerable and prone to mistakes. As Molly delves deeper into the case, she starts to devise a plan to use Carly as the key to unlock the secrets Sonny has been hiding. This not only threatens Sonny's career, but could also lead to the collapse of the entire Corinthos family if the truth comes to light. Molly, making strides in her investigation into John's death, starts to see that the key to uncovering the whole truth might lie with Carly, the woman Sonny deeply trusts and shares a close bond with. Determined to discover the connection between Sonny and John's death, Molly decides to approach Carly, believing that through her, she can uncover the secrets Sonny is hiding. Initially, Carly is not easily persuaded to open up to Molly. She has doubted many people before, and her relationship with Sonny has always been complex, filled with mixed emotions. However, Molly skillfully exploits the cracks in their relationship. She knows that Carly is a strong woman, but also one who can be deeply hurt when her emotions are tested. Molly approaches Carly with gentle questions, emphasizing that she only wants to uncover the truth and help Carly see things more clearly. Through each conversation, Molly gradually pulls Carly into her investigation, leading Carly to start questioning the true nature of Sonny's relationship with Natalina. Carly, who has already had doubts about Sonny's loyalty, finds herself in a situation she can no longer avoid. The information Molly brings forces her to confront the affair between Sonny and Natalina. Carly starts feeling deceived and betrayed, emotions she can no longer control. She recalls signs she once overlooked, small lies from Sonny that she used to believe. Everything begins to connect in Carly's mind, and now she realizes she may have been living in a lie all along. Molly continues to push forward with her investigation, but this time, she no longer has to search on her own. Carly, in her anger and pain, decides to cooperate with Molly to uncover the full truth. Carly understands that continuing to hide or protect Sonny would only make her a victim of her own choices, and she is determined not to let that happen. The confrontation between Carly and Sonny becomes more heated than ever before. Carly confronts Sonny about his affair with Natalina, about the times he lied and hid the truth. Sonny tries to defend himself, denying that the relationship was serious, but Carly no longer believes his excuses. Carly's emotions explode, and she is forced to face the reality that Sonny has not only betrayed her emotionally, but also broken the trust he had once promised. The argument is not just about Sonny's infidelity with Natalina, but a much larger betrayal of the trust Carly placed in him. Carly feels as if her entire world is crumbling, and Sonny, the man she once loved with all her heart, has become the person who hurt her the most. Molly, although not intending to cause this breakdown, has brought forth a truth that has become the turning point, leaving Carly with no choice but to move forward. Carly is faced with a difficult decision. Can she forgive Sonny and continue their marriage, or will this betrayal be the end of their relationship? Molly's progress in her investigation has not only revealed the secrets behind John's death, but also shaken Carly and Sonny's entire world, pushing them into an unavoidable crisis. Carly, in a moment of overwhelming anger and frustration, lost control of her emotions, which led to her unintentionally revealing a major secret that Sonny had been hiding all along. As she confronted Sonny about his relationship with Natalina, Carly didn't just question his infidelity, but also mentioned some suspicious activities that she couldn't shake. In the heat of their fiery argument, Carly let slip a crucial detail related to John's death, a detail Molly immediately grasped. Molly, who had been following and investigating John's death, 
quickly realized that Carly had just revealed a vital clue she had been searching for. In her emotional outburst, Carly mentioned an instance where Sonny had admitted to some involvement in the case, though not in full detail. Molly swiftly pieced together all the clues, and the horrifying truth began to emerge. Sonny had a hand in John's death, and this was the crime he had been trying to cover up. Carly, though unintentionally, had helped Molly put together the final piece of the puzzle in her investigation. Now, Molly knows she has the evidence to send Sonny to prison. This discovery is not just the culmination of her long investigation, but the key to taking down one of the most powerful figures in Port Charles. Molly understands that sending Sonny to jail will not be easy, given his extensive network of power and influence, but she is determined not to let his crime go unpunished. The crisis between Carly and Sonny is no longer just about their relationship. It has now become a major legal storm, as Sonny's criminal secret is brought to light. Carly, after realizing she unintentionally helped Molly, feels guilty and confused, but she knows that the truth can no longer be hidden. Molly, with the critical information in hand, is preparing for the final step, to expose Sonny and ensure that he pays for his actions. Sonny's fate now seems sealed, and facing justice is just a matter of time.